handguns, rifles, an AK-47, and some throwing stars. Just a few of the items found inside a Girard home. Police were investigating shots fired on Iowa Street, and some of the bullets hit a neighbor's house with people inside. 27 First News Weekend anchor Julie Burst spent the day going through the police report, talking to a neighbor about what she saw and heard. Yeah, the neighbors inside their house, they weren't hurt by any of these gunshots, which came from that AK-47. But today I learned the man police arrested for all this, Elmer Gordon, was on probation for a prior weapons release. Police tape covers this house on Iowa Street in Girard. My neighbor called and she said he shot up the neighbor's house. The neighbor asked we not show her face, but was willing to talk about what she saw and heard last night. The guy was out on his yard just wasted. He, you could tell he was drunk. When Gerard police got there, they found Elmer Gordon in the front yard, holding a bottle of booze and his hands raised on his head. Police asked if he had a weapon and he pointed to the house. Inside, police found an AK-47 and 11 bullet holes. Some of those shots went through the house and into the neighbor's house. While they were inside, no one was hurt. I have to give it to the young man who lives there in that house that got shot, that he didn't go after him. Along with the AK-47, police found a lot of other guns in the house. These are some of the pictures of the guns. They also found ammunition, brass knuckles, throwing stars, and items used to grow marijuana. So the neighbor I spoke to tells me for the most part, this is a quiet street. Really, the only problem she notices is people not stopping at that stop sign behind me. Gordon is charged with using a weapon while intoxicated and firing into a home. He is on probation for a previous weapons offense. Today, WKBN called Gerard Municipal Court. Gordon's bond was set at $100,000. He's also due back in court next week. Live in the studio, Julie Bursick, WKBN 27 First News at 6.